I've got 10 purple wild grape air layers here today and we are unwrapping them and we're finding some good little root growth typically at the node at the top that's what we've got on those other two let's see what this one looks like Yeah, we can see the roots right there. Okay, we're not going to disturb these much more here. We're going to prepare the soil and get these in the ground, packed with some good, highly nutritious soil. And it's going into a sandy area. Also, I got three big vines here that I took roots up with, three, three big ones. And here's a row already that we've planted of the black wild grape. And you can see it's a very um, sandy, sandy soil here, folks. So it, you know, needs more nutrients, but it's well drained and we are, we're giving it nutrients. That's what the 16 foot trailer and the compost piles over there and everywhere are here's two big piles of aged wood chips over here and we got a little bit of some ground cover with those so we get all these big vines sticking out here we'll see how it goes we're going to get them up on a trellis and see what we can grow and get up on some vines um, those are the black wild we're going to do two rows of those and we're going to do one of the purple and then all over here this is sugar cane in here and Berries and other things way down there. All right, I'm going to get to unwrapping these things and getting them in the ground.